This court finds that the petitioner's petition is unmerited and is hereby dismissed with case. Independence Party, the Kenya African National Union Kano, has lost its quest to repossess the Kenyatta International Conference Center, KICC. The Lands and Environment Court has termed a petition filed by Kanu as unmerited and consequently dismissed their case. A declaration is hereby issued that LR 209-11157 was obtained illegally, unlawfully, and procedurally, and without following legal procedure, and hence analysis had been issued. Justice Jacqueline Mogheni ruled that Kano had illegally and procedurally and unlawfully acquired KICC and the land where the iconic building stands. That the title for LR number 209 stock 11157 in the name of the first respondent, the cross petition, is hereby revoked. Instead, the Lands and Environment Court has upheld the Minister of Tourism as the legal owner of the property in dispute. A declaration is hereby issued that the Ministry of Tourism is the lawful owner of the suit land LR 209 stock 19829 and the first respondent registration of LR 2091157 is unlawful, illegal and it's a constitution. The ruling father states the ministry is legally the owner of all lands across the country where iconic structures stand. Kanu had argued that it acquired the disputed land in the year 1969 before being handed the title documents in 1989. The judge says the documents are illegal. That the title documents and leasehold interest created in LR number 209 1-1-1-5-7 is illegal. The Independence Party lost ownership of KICC in February 2003 following a presidential executive order issued by then President Mwai Kibaki. The order came a few months after Kanu was dislodged from power. Four years ago, Kanu moved the Lands and Environment Court to wrestle back KICC from the government before today's ruling that brings to an end the ownership tussle. Notably, KICC is among the parastatals the government intends to privatize. Timothy Simuake, 24TV.